Hey guys, uh, today we're going to be showing you how to self-pollinate uh, a Venus flytrap flower. Uh, these flowered, the middle one flowered two days ago and then these two popped up this morning. So you want to wait just a couple of days, usually one or two days, and you'll notice that the stigma here is more uh, fluffy and uh, a little more receptive to pollen after a day or two whereas these other guys that stigma is still still just kind of a, 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 a it's hasn't quite opened yet so you're going to take a, a brush that has never been used before um, sterile brush so let this get back into focus here there we go and we're just going to take dab these pollen bristles on the that are outside you'll pick up just a little pollen like that and then you're going to dab that right into the into the stigma there and we'll just do that again with several of these Over the next couple of weeks, this will close and kind of harden, and you'll be able to see if it was successful if it, if it drops uh, seed. You can also hybridize plants this way. Um, requires a little, little more info, but we'll be doing another video on that real soon. Um, also, my next video will be how to pollinate a, a dress or a sundew. Uh, it's very similar but kind of slightly different so uh, keep keep checking out my videos for for more info on plant care and uh, Venus flytrap and sundew care and thanks again